my sadness with other people and my anger. I've felt disoriented all day with this election. I just came from a class and everyone was brokenhearted. Uh, it was a class for English language learners at RIC. And uh, one of the dads talked about taking his daughters to go vote. And one of the daughters was so proud to be able to vote for a woman with her mom. And she said, if, I, if, if she wins, these are going to be my lucky socks. And then Hillary lost. And she was, he was just so dispirited and broken and having to share this experience with his kids. We're here to protest Donald Trump's presidency because it doesn't support our lives at all. I, this is my first protest, so I feel very glad to know there's people who understand that our lives do that. Well, for me personally, I was upset not only for me, but also for a lot of people I know who are Muslim, who are immigrants, who are LGBTQ plus people. And even for me personally, it was upsetting knowing that now my life is in danger as well as the lives of so many others. Standing against hate for hate against religion, hate against sexism, hate against misogyny, hate against xenophobia. I'm really standing for what I think is the greater good. And I think our the current election uh, results really speaks against a lot of America and especially Providence, and I couldn't be happier to be in a city that really promotes, um, that promotes equality.